The NetApp FAS V-Series Storage Replication Adapter 2.1 for Clustered Data ONTAP is a storage plugin for VMware Site Recovery Manager that enables interaction between Site Recovery Manager and the storage controller. The adapter interacts with the underlying storage on behalf of SRM to discover storage arrays and their associated data stores and RDM devices connected to vSphere. Before installing the SRA, take a moment to read through the SRA 2.1 Installation and Administration Guide. The guide covers all the required procedures from preparing your NAS and SAN environment, replication from the protected to recovery sites using SnapMirror, installing and configuring the SRA inside of vSphere, and lastly, a comprehensive list of error messages for troubleshooting. In a NAS environment, be sure to install the SRA on both the protected and recovery site. Ensure volumes are mounted on junction paths associated to a valid export policy. The NFS server is running for the destination storage virtual machine. And lastly, verify that the ESXi hosts at the recovery storage system have a VM kernel port that can access the IP addresses used to serve NFS exports from the storage virtual machine. In a SAN environment, be sure to install the SRM server at the protected and recovery sites. That ESXi hosts are connected to LUNs in the protected site. Ensure that the LUNs, iSCSI, Fiber Channel, or both are in groups of OS type VMware on the primary storage virtual machine. Lastly, ensure that the ESXi hosts at the recovery site have appropriate Fiber Channel or iSCSI connectivity to the recovery site storage virtual machine. In order for SRM to work correctly, data stores need to be replicated from the protected to the recovery site. You can verify this using On Command System Manager or the Data On Tap CLI. Your source path should be your protected site storage virtual machine, colon, your protected volume. Type should be DP, and your destination path should be your recovery site storage virtual machine, colon, recovery volume. The NetApp SRA is a Windows installer package that can be found on support.netapp.com. Be sure to install the adapter on both the protected and recovery site SRM servers. When the adapter has been installed on both sites, launch SRM and click the Configure Connection button to connect your protected and recovery sites. On the bottom left, click on Array Managers, and then over on the top right, click on Add Array Manager. At a minimum, you'll need to enter the cluster management IP address of the storage system, the name of the storage virtual machine, and then a user with cluster admin privileges. We'll cover some of the additional features like volume include and volume exclude later. When finished, repeat these steps on the recovery site. Next, click on the Array Pairs tab. Now click the Enable link on the right to enable this array pair. SRM will run the storage discovery process. When the storage discovery process completes, the SRM interface will show the array pair as enabled and list the name of the Remote Array Manager in the Remote Array Manager column. The storage replication adapter discovers all the replicated devices in a pair of SVMs, along with their destination export path or LUN path and device ID. If you want the SRA to discover specific volumes, you can specify the volumes in the Volume Include or Exclude list of Array Manager. By clicking on the Devices tab, I can see all data stores replicated between my SVMs. The blue arrow indicates the direction of the replication. In my example, I want to exclude any volumes containing the characters BCN. I'll start by right-clicking my SVM and selecting Edit Array Manager. Under Volume Exclude List, I will add the characters BCN. If I were to add BCN to the Include List, only volumes containing BCN would be displayed. Clicking on Refresh will discover the replicated devices and exclude the previously listed BCN data store. The error reminds me I need to add the exclusion on both the protected and recovery SVMs. I'll repeat the same process of excluding any data store that contains the characters BCN on my recovery site. Another refresh shows the BCN data store is now successfully excluded from my list of replicated data stores. The Storage Replication Adapter configuration file enables you to customize some of the disaster recovery behaviors, including the security settings, during the Site Recovery Manager recovery or test recovery operation. 
For detailed information on configuring the SRA using the ONTAP config file, download the SRA 2.1 Installation and Administration Guide from support.netapp.com.